Crowd favorite and Miss Maracas Valley, Ashe Abrams, was crowned the new Miss World TNT 2022 and will represent Trinidad and Tobago at the 71st Miss World pageant next year. Reporter Kimberly D'Souza checked in with the 23-year-old aspiring actress to see how her life has changed as she prepares for the global competition. Ashe Abrahams has gone through a transformation. The 23-year-old beauty from La Saiva village, Maracas Valley, stole the hearts of the judges and Trinbegonians on the night of the Miss World TNT competition and won the privilege to represent the red, white and black on the world stage in 2023. Being in this position, I think it's a victory for myself and proving to my younger self that really it was all in my mind. You know, it was about being confident and really standing up and saying this is who I am and accept me or not, this is who I am. Still, the Valley Girl admitted she has kept a piece of herself. The person that I am today is completely different, or I would say she is different to who walked in, but I didn't lose my core self. I just added to that. Ashe cherished the friendship she made with the other delegates during the local leg of the competition and is confident their friendship will not end, regardless of the outcome, on the final night. Many believe it was Ashe's response to her question on the final night which gave her an edge over her competitors. Well, unfortunately, this has been an issue that we still need to fix. But I think as being in any position of power that we need to be aware of what's happening on the ground. And a lot of the times crime stems from socioeconomic difficulties. And that's what we need to be mindful of because it's easy to judge the actions. But how about we focus on the root of the issue? Because it was a tough question, I'll be honest. But in that moment, I see, I think a lot of people pointed out, I smiled at the audience because their response was funny. The fact that, you know, that I knew Everyone thought it was a difficult um, question, allowed me to kind of let it go. And I said in the moment to myself, just speak, speak from your heart. While Ashe's immediate goal is to bring home the crown, she has plans to tackle the very issue she remains vocal about upon her return. So I hope that when I go out there and I do well, because I'm praying that I do, I can have even more resources to bring back to us, to continue the conversation and to speak to people who are in power. She is thankful for her supporters, the very proud residents of Maracas Valley. And she's eternally grateful to her parents. And while you can take the girl out of the valley, as she remains a Maracas resident through and through, she left us with some words of advice. Because the best experiences I had were here. It was running around barefoot in the village, climbing trees, falling off of trees sometimes, I'll admit. But it was always the fun that we had. So remember to cherish where you come from, who you are, and allow it to, to make you a better person. Filled with national pride and armed with support from her community and country, the all-round Valley Girl plans to bring home the Miss World 2022 crown. We wish her all the best in the competition. I am Kimberly D'Souza and this is See Yourself on